so here we have a 35 year old female who's presented with fatigability and drooping of eyelids which worsens after exercise the most important clue here is that it worsens after exercise which gives away the diagnosis of myasthenia gravis so this female would be positive for which hla subtype so hla subtypes associations with disease is a very important topic frequently asked questions are there on this topic so we would see the mnemonics to remember the hla subtypes so in hla subtypes we start with hla b so we have hla b5 we have hla b8 and we have hla b27 so b5 is associated with besets disease how do we remember that so besets is b e is alphabet number 5 so besets is b5 or b51 so remember b51 b5 association then we have b8 which can be read as bet that is b8 so i bet you that it would be a magic if you see somebody's graves which is in the ceiling so grave in ceiling is a magic so b8 mnemonic is magic whose grave is it it is the grave of myasthenia gravis and his son's graves is in ceiling so if we decode this mnemonic so magic stands for myasthenia and his son is addison grave is graves disease ceiling is celiac screw so myasthenia addison grave and celiac are associated with b8 so b8 is a bet that it's a magic then we have b27 which is the most frequently and commonly asked we all know it is associated with ankylosing spondylitis the other conditions it is associated with is we remember it by the mnemonic pair so 27 is the age when you get married and become a couple or a pair so that stands for psoriasis ankylosing spondylitis inflammatory bowel disease and retos so basically these are all spondyloarthropathies which are associated with hla b27 so those are the hla types b then we have hla dr hla dr 2 3 4 5 and 7 6 is in a fix so it is not there so we have 2 3 4 5 7 so in hla dr 2 so it is journey of doctor to becoming ms so journey of becoming doctor to ms that is surgeon so dr2 is associated with multiple sclerosis hla dr3 so remember that 2 3 is butter free 3 4 is sugar free so butter free is basically butterfly the butterfly rash which is seen in sle so sle is associated with dr23 sugar free means diabetes mellitus which type type 1 that is insulin dependent so diabetes mellitus type 1 is 3 4 then we have dr5 so 5 is basically hampanch so that stands for Hashimoto's and pernicious anemia so 5 is associated with Hashimoto's and pernicious anemia 
then we have dr7 so 7 is associated with steroid responsive nephrotic syndrome so 7 is steroid responsive nephrotic syndrome which hla subtype is associated with rheumatoid arthritis so rheumatoid arthritis so room that is a room has four walls so it is associated with dr4 so rheumatoid arthritis is dr4 hla subtype associated with celiac sprue or celiac disease so in celiac disease wheat is avoided the hla subtype associated is dq28 to remember we have wheat dq that is in hindi wheat dq to celiac patient so wheat dq to celiac patient so dq2 is celiac disease so these are the important hla subtypes and their associations this is an exhaustive list but at the same time important if you revise it frequently you will remember it very easily and in a better way so coming back to our question so this was myasthenia gravis so we know that myasthenia gravis that is the grave of myasthenia in ceiling it was a magic that was a bet that is b8 so it is associated with b8 dr2 we saw 23 is butter free that is sle 34 is sugar free that is diabetes 27 is pear those are the spondyloarthropathies